Hello, welcome to Invictus Motors, and this is a Beetle specialist in West London. I mean, you could see a Beetle there, a Beetle right there. They're called Terry's Beetles. I've just purchased this Beetle from a very good friend of mine, David. And uh, these guys took an absolutely amazing care of this Beetle, and its name is Lloyd. And uh, I'm going to invite you to the back of Lloyd and actually talk to you about the engine work it's had done. Other than you know the, the, the main topic of this video in terms of what they've done for us here to get this running absolutely spot on, what it came in here for is a proper health check, you know, an MOT level check, checking the brakes, checking the ball joints, overall the health of everything that's concerned and that's related to this vehicle. I'm going to get the, the little sheet uh, of work so in total it's had 675 pounds spent on it and one of the main things it's had is a proper full service where they check the timing the carburetors the belt um, this is a proper you know top down full-on comprehensive service another thing that's got changed was the ignition distributor and other smaller areas that I'm going to talk about at the front of the vehicle. As you can see, they're actually changing the bumper. It's had also the valve clearance sorted out as well, four times spark plugs done, and the timing was set. And uh, above all, one thing that was quite important to get done on this also was the gearbox mount. And then from any perishable wear and tear items, it's also had the ball joint, uh, the ball joints, uh, four times ball joints done. Now, little details, which is what I like about the Terrace Beetles, is it's had the fuel cap replaced and this little rubber flap here as well that's been replaced as well. The tiny little attention to detail. And this is an absolutely incredible service from the Terrace Beetles. And let me just show you around the workshop as well here. I mean, some of the cars they have is absolutely incredible. A Beetle here to the left, a Beetle to the right. And furthermore, you come down into the rest of the workshop. You might think on the face of it, they're just a small little workshop, but God, oh God, just look at the, the, the space here. This is a camper van here, as you can see. Just looking underneath of this camper van, quite interesting, very fascinating. This camper van is called Pan, Panny maybe. And another beetle there, an exact replica, well, not an exact, uh, a precisely similar beetle as ours. I mean, this is, this is quite a rotten one, as you can see here, from all the rotten bits here on the chassis, and you can see on the floor pan, the floor pan here is all being done and all being replaced. You know, all the, all the brakes being overhauled, all of this being done. And it just goes to show the condition of that VW Beetle that I've just purchased from my friend David is absolutely <laughs> spot on it's mega and um, yeah it's nice to come to a place like this Terry's Beetles and to, 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 to kind of give this that absolutely very important check to make sure that I'm safe on the road and whoever is going to be owning this down the line in the future when I'm bored of it is going to be absolutely safe on the road and the finishing touches is this brand new chrome bumper and boy oh boy just look at the difference and as I said just showing just showing you what I showed you on the other beetle about the inside being corroded and damaged and floor pans being corroded damaged etc this doesn't have that issue and the tires look in absolutely sublime condition I mean overall yes other than a wash and a good polish and probably just this bit of Corrosion right here being addressed. The rest of the condition is spot on. Couldn't have asked for a better car. I mean, I've had a look underneath the front uh, bonnet. Everything is intact. It's not rotten. It's not broken to pieces. And now on the inside, boy oh boy, have I had some old Porsches. I've had old motorbikes like a Ducati. And that door, when you slam it and you shut it, God, it sounds good. It feels good. And this is just so intact it's so well looked after the paperwork the owner's history it's all spot on and i couldn't have asked for a better beetle to own i mean this is what i call what the porsches were based on 
and for the price and for the condition, you know, you don't need to spend another £10,000 to get it to this condition. I mean, it is overall in this absolutely perfect spot on original condition. And that is, I mean, the headlining, that seat belts installed, everything works on it. So what I would be actually doing now is starting the car now. Let me find out what I've done with the keys. Let me find the keys. I'll start the car and take you out for a drive in it. Now we are onto the inside of the Beetle. We're on the road. We've had the wiper motor replaced. And gosh, this drives like an absolute dream. The gears changes extremely well. It's a smooth ride. It's a fun ride. I'm doing about 20 miles an hour in second gear. The brakes bite exactly as they should. And what a pleasure to drive something like this. Totally, totally original. And that spring that you get in the seats, it's just out of this world, that feeling, you know, makes me feel like I belong in the 60s or the 70s or maybe in the 50s, you know. So, going to be having the time of my life driving this today with this lovely weather. Couldn't have wanted to be in a better and a more comfortable place in a nicer place and what a joy to be doing what I'm doing aha so first gear again Oof. it goes yes and yes it might be just 1300 cc only but it pulls it pulls I can't wait to get it up on the motorway now. It's going to be a lot of fun. And guess what we are picking up? We're picking up an Aston Martin AMR Hero Edition. It's a 2020 plate. And those two cars have something in, in common. Both are manual. Other than that, I can't wait to get on the motorway soon. Now we're at 30 miles an hour, third gear, and it's a, an absolute joy. Now we're here at the back of Terry's Beetles, and, and this, this is the bit of the workshop that I didn't really get to show to you earlier, because this is it's such a huge big workshop, it just keep carry on going back and back and there's more space. I didn't know that there was a body shop there at the back. This is a Beetle that they've completely restored from you know, the ground up and uh, it's absolutely mega. This is worth something around 50,000 pounds. And then you come here to the back and you find this beautiful little scooter that they're working on and they're just refurbing this and just getting it absolutely spot on to what it should be. And overall, if you are looking for something comprehensive and something uh, from a workshop point of view that practically offers you everything that you could ever imagine, uh, from a place i mean this is like a turnkey solution to a classic car to to a beetle to maybe you know whatever you dream of come down to terry's beetles here in west london in hanwell and you know i can't believe over all these years i didn't know a place like this existed but here we are so thank you one more time and see you next time bye bye <laughs>